Good evening and welcome to this edition of Midweek Mana on this Wednesday, uh, November 15th. I uh, welcome you this day and I hope that something that is said uh, during this time together will uh, stick with you. So this night for me, um, the topic, you know, we're talking about worthy, 10 mindful moments to add to your day. And so uh, this evening, I want to talk about you are more than what you have to offer. You know, we live in a world and a society, actually, in which we're told that we are only valued if we have a good car or a good job or a nice house or, the, you know, the perfect relationship or the right amount of money in the bank. And the reality is that all those things can go away tomorrow. But God values us regardless of what we have and regardless of what we don't have. And so when we think about value, we sometimes get it twisted in that we value what other people think about us as opposed to what God thinks about us. I've been there, and maybe you have too. None of that matters to God. All God wants is for us to offer ourselves to God and remind ourselves that we are worthy no matter what we do, no matter where we go, no matter our status, our job, the house we live in, none of those things matter to God because we are already of value to God. And as a child of God, God wants us to remember that and God wants us to, to rest in that understanding that we are valued. We are a beloved child of God. And we don't have to run this rat race uh, that we have to do to keep up with the Joneses, so to speak, and continue on this hamster wheel as I talked earlier today in the earlier uh, midweek man of this day. So I want to leave you with this, this scripture. Uh, 2 Timothy 2.13 says, If we are faithless, God remains faithful, for God cannot deny God's self. God loves us even in those moments when we might not love God or even when we feel like God doesn't love us. God always and will continue to love us. Will you pray with me? Gracious God, we thank you that you remind us through your word that we are of value and that we are worthy and that we are indeed your beloved children. So God, I thank you for this reminder that you continue to give to us. And God, right now, I lift up to you those of us that may be hurting physically, uh, mentally, emotionally. God, I just ask you will just be with, uh, be with us and give us your peace and understanding. God, remind us that we're not alone in the battles that we fight. God, remind us that you are with us in our pain and you are there to take away the pain and give us peace within ourselves. So God, I just ask right now, you would just remind us that you are in control, that you are the one that has our back all the time. Our friends come, our friends go, our families come, our families go, but you, God, are always there. And we thank you for that. We thank you for reminding us that we can have peace, even in the midst of the chaos and the craziness that goes on in our day, if we just stop, pause, and rest. So God, thank you for this time. And I pray that you will bless somebody through these words, God, and bless someone through this prayer. We thank you and praise you. And all that is holy, especially in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And I'll share. Thanks for listening. I appreciate you doing this. I love doing these, doing these every week. And I hope indeed they touch you in your life. Take care. Bye-bye.